view at the Michelin Pilot Plus AT tires 235, 45, 17. Z rated tires. These are all season tires in uh, serious winter conditions here. And basically, on every corner here, I'm slipping, activating traction control, and uh, ending up drifting. Um, it's a good demonstration of why a winter tire would be much more adequate in this scenario. Now these tires are actually doing pretty dang well considering their true design purpose and a lot of this is due to the fact that the car's got traction control and stability control and all kinds of doodads to make the car work better. But it still shows, you know, that at the margins the car is on the edge of, of losing control very easily. If, especially if you push any any corners in here maybe I can show you what I'm talking about right there just went sideways across the road I'm about to upgrade to some uh, snow tires now that I'm almost done testing these tires for the winter and uh, but it does give you a good idea here I'm bogging down in second gear and almost uh, having the car quit just from the lack of traction. Hopefully I can get up my driveway. These stairs have done really well considering everything, but they're definitely nowhere nearly as good as a dedicated winter tire, especially in these conditions. But I think you can see some of the control issues I've been having that it really shows how an all-season tire is not designed for serious winter conditions, especially on a mountain road like this. Got another corner down here. And doing another little slip and slide. take this corner in first gear just to show the difference and here the traction control activating see that the car is having problems now this is going up a pretty serious grade here so it's actually making it quite a bit better than it really is if it was a flat or downhill sloping situation I would have easily have hit the uh, side of the road already so that's it for tragedy for now. Have a good night. Adios.